I'm Dan Ackerman, and we are here taking a look at the Alienware 14. Uh, Alienware, a division of Dell, has stripped down uh, its product names, at least. These used to be called things like the M14 or M14X. Uh, now it's just the Alienware 14. As you can tell, it has a 14-inch screen. Unlike most of the laptops that we've seen this year, this is not a touch screen. In fact, even Otter, it's not even Windows 8. This is actually a Windows 7 laptop, although you can get Windows 8 as an add-on. That's largely because gamers seem to prefer Windows 7. They, they don't like to go through the uh, Windows 8 tile interface to get to their games. I think at the end of the day, it doesn't really make a huge difference. Uh, this has Windows 7, which may feel like a bit of a throwback. Also feeling like a throwback is the fact that this thing is huge. For 14 inch laptop, look how thick and gigantic and heavy this is. You could really stack up two or three Ultrabooks next to it and get to about the same thickness. Uh, of course, that's so they can cram in all the high-end gaming parts. And Alienware, like other high-end gaming laptop manufacturers, gives you a lot of options uh, to choose uh, you know, CPUs and GPUs and different types of hard drives. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised at this particular configuration we have that's $1799. It's got a fourth generation uh, Intel Core i7 CPU. It's got NVIDIA's uh, 765M GPU, which is pretty good. And it's got a dual hard drive that's a 256 gig solid state drive and a 750 gig regular hard drive. All that together was $1799. It's not a huge bargain, but I'm very comfortable paying that price for those parts uh, in this model, especially because it has a full 1920 by 1080 screen. And the other 14 inch super gaming laptop that we've seen recently, the Razer uh, Blade 14, uh, it's much thinner, has reasonably similar parts, but it has a terrible screen that has a lower resolution and does not look nearly as nice as this one. Of course, because it's an Alienware, you get all the uh, crazy kooky lights uh, like back here and the running lights on the side. I particularly like the, the backlit touchpad. That's a new touch that is probably the, the only kind of goofy visual aesthetic thing that I really like about it. Uh, the rest of it is a little bit uh, dorm room chic, uh, but if you're in the market for an Alienware, you know what you're getting. I'm Dan Ackerman, and that is the Dell Alienware 14.